Hello. <clears throat> I'm just uh, here having shoveled the path uh, to the generator. And uh, the uh, generator electrical switching situation. I'm going to have a little path uh, shoveled there with a little U turn in it. And we're sitting now underneath the white cedar. Uh, maybe we can call it grove, which is beside the propane and bamboo. I'll shovel to the propane next. Uh, and uh, I'm gonna actually have a little tripod this time. How about that? So we'll see if I can set it down in the snow a little bit. I'm gonna try and aim it a little bit upwards so that uh, you might see some of the snow falling. There's snow falling. Sun reminding me uh, the snow that it uh, can be liquid. It's falling out around me here. And uh, I can see the texture of the snow changing. Uh, you know where the sun has hit it. Uh, and then you see just right beside that area where there's some shadow and the completely different texture of the snow. It's quite interesting. Uh, so, uh, Anyway, what I'm here is uh, shoveling my way to the propane tanks on the property, shoveling my way to the service entrances, shoveling my way to the firewood, shoveling my way to the uh, 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 split ductless outdoor units, sho shoveling my way to the uh, dryer vent, shoveling my way to the, uh, the uh, in wall, through wall, um, vent in the studio, shoveling my way to the mailbox, and uh, shoveling my way to the oil and diesel fill, shoveling my way to where the farrier parks, uh, so we have some room, shoveling my way to the uh, uh, yard drains and electrical services, points at each of the paddocks, shoveling my way to the little free library, so all these, uh, you know, non-driveway, non-front door kind of things. And the reason, of course, is so that service people have access to the service points. I'm sure that uh, we're unlikely to need all or many or maybe any of these service points serviced while the snow is here. Uh, but we may. And uh, I'm sure even if I didn't have it shoveled, they're used to it <laughs> and they expect it and they have boots and warm clothes but it might seem kind of nice to have it shoveled to have a service person recognize that they've been thought about before they're needed hawk just cried out overhead anyway so what I'm doing I'm kind of engaged in a practice a uh, piece fell here in the storm. That smells so strong. You hear the hawk overhead crying? I can see a few branches that have come down here in the storm where they'll come. And uh, if I happen to see the hawk, I'll, I'll move the camera to see if you get a shot uh, at seeing her. Anyway, uh, I'm thinking about um, those people uh, and services who may do some help. So we're helping the helpers, serving the servers, uh, and proactively, right? before we need to help, whether or not we need to help. The point is that we're in a mind state of help. But I'm also resting here, both uh, both the camera and my arms on the generator, which is certainly a, a nice symbol of uh, will or energy 
uh, perhaps kidneys, perhaps the heart. It's a, the electrical heart of the property. Uh, when the power's out, the on-site electrical heart. And of course your physical heart is the on-site electrical heart uh, for your system, for your property, if, if you will, your, your, uh, your home area. So I thought maybe I'll do a little meditation of uh, generation, which is many generations old. <laughs> so uh, let me try this. We may be interrupted by vehicles driving behind me because we're right next to the driveway, but they'll probably rumble past not seeing uh, me in here. Uh, so yeah, I think I guess uh, that's aimed a little bit, so I'll do a little meditation in here. Not much room, but uh, I just think I'm probably in the frame. Oh, actually, that's a good idea. There's a little stone wall here. That, uh, I don't, yeah, you probably can't see it. Uh, well, I guess I can. Let me see if I can aim it since we have the little tripod. Let's see how this goes. Something more like that. Yeah, that's, that's kind of all right. Once I got here, I realized I didn't have much room. I realized that uh, this little stone wall, which I shoveled around, I could practice. Straddling, which uh, of course will make the uh, Fuyin cold. So, uh, but that's okay. It'll be part of the practice uh, of generating uh, where uh, the warmth is drawn out. Uh, so that's okay. So I'm going to do a different uh, variation than I than I was going to do. Now that I'm sitting here and feeling the uh, cold under me, but it's a nice little course dance training so why not so I'll just do one that's uh, a little bit more uh, 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 generating because we have a generator and uh, so I'm just trying to decide which level I like to do this I'm gonna start on the heart and we'll see if I move it off but my intention here is out Tension here is in. And there's snow and ice is very cold <laughs> I'm sitting on. So I normally I do a lower stance with this, but I'm actually stopped by the stone wall. So I'm only, you know, I'm working quite a bit here with the legs, but it's in a stance. And I'll probably change the mood that I hear as I go. snow a little so I can take a lower stance. So I'm actually standing in a lower stance. Uh, I don't know if it looks like I'm seated or not, but I'm, uh, I'm just above it and having crushed it down. So it's pretty, uh, you know, push it down a little more. <sighs> well, that was, <laughs> that was tough. And I actually kind of moved my feet there as my butt shifted and I did sit on it. My right hand is closer, the thumb and two forefingers indicating uh, sort of T8, T17 area. A 
That's our little uh, meditation <laughs> with the uh, generator uh, there. So uh, get back to shoveling, I guess. So thank you all very much. And uh, if this video sideways, I'm holding the camera sideways on the tripod. I don't know if Facebook uprights it or not. So, thank you.